The breasts are a mixture of fibrous tissue and glandular tissue, commonly referred to as fibroglandular tissue, as well as fatty breast tissue. Every woman has a different mixture of these two types of tissue. Women who have a lot of the fibroglandular tissue are considered to have dense breasts. The only way that you know that you have dense breasts is when a radiologist looks at your mammogram. Dense breasts are not something that your doctor can feel on physical examination or not something that you yourself can feel. Dense breasts are purely defined by what your mammogram pictures look like. So having dense breasts does increase your risk of breast cancer by a little bit. It's not the same risk factor as say having a strong family history of breast cancer or having a personal history of breast cancer, but it does come with a slightly elevated breast cancer risk. The challenge or the added challenge for having dense breasts is that it makes it more difficult to find breast cancer on your mammogram pictures. Just like the fibroglandular tissue on the mammogram appears white, so do many of the malignant things that we look for in mammogram pictures. And that means that finding them can be more of a challenge in women with dense breast tissue. Tomosynthesis, or 3D mammography, does a bit better job in finding breast cancers in all women, but in particular women with dense breast tissue. Tomosynthesis is an exam that, as a patient, feels very much like a regular 2D mammogram. The machine operates a bit differently, but the patient experience is very much the same. If you receive a letter telling you that you have dense breast tissue on your mammogram, you should definitely reach out to your doctor and discuss whether some additional testing might be appropriate for you. Depending upon what other risk factors you may have, you may be a candidate for additional breast imaging exams. Having dense breast tissue does not mean that you will get breast cancer. It does mean that you need to be vigilant in getting mammograms once a year, every year and adding whatever supplemental screening test is appropriate for your level of risk. As radiologists who are experts in breast imaging, we are always here to answer your questions about breast density and breast imaging 